Hi guys, so as you know, I went to Lady Gaga on Wednesday. It was probably one of the most amazing nights of my whole life. But before I tell you about the concert, I have to show you all of the stuff from us getting ready. I didn't go to this concert by myself. I went with three other friends. Here's some random videos of us getting ready. So this is Emily. This is Becca. And this is Hi. Kristen. <laughs> We're all getting oh. ready. Look how cute we are. I wear the pearls because I like juxtaposition. Like, I can't figure out how probably don't want it in my boobs because it might never come out. We're on our way. Really no Are you guys excited? Yeah. What? Excited? I'm excited. Yeah. My brothers are like jealous right now. He really wanted to come. You should hear him sing to Lady Gaga with his cracky voice. Oh god. Aww. Cut in the bedroom, man. I'm sorry, David. Is this too boring? Should we be more excited? Should I say musical theater a lot? <laughs> musical theater! Musical theater! Musical theater! <laughs> I'm gonna name my child uh, Alejandro Fernando Roberto Roberto Cilantro Now I'm showing you these videos kind of to make up for the fact that I couldn't get my camera inside to the concert because I was afraid it would get confiscated. But my friend Becca did take some pictures from inside the stadium. And we took a lot of really flattering photos in there. We walked into the stadium and it was like huge. The opening band, which was semi precious Weapons, was kind of horrible. I don't know if any of you liked them, but I hated it. I felt kind of like I was watching Chris Crocker if he had a band and was opening for Lady Gaga. And then after about 20 minutes of setup, Lady Gaga finally came on and I went insane. She looked incredible. She must have had like... 14 outfits or something like that and they were all insane and really cool and all the dancing was fantastic and all of her dancers were awesome and really hot. The whole production was like insane. There was a whole story and there were little like bits and pieces of scenes in between. And there were like all these different set pieces and transitions. There were these um video interludes that had her like in black and white doing different like artsy shit. It was awesome. And of course she sounded amazing and she played piano and that was amazing and the band was insane. I think she went for like two and a half hours almost. She did not hold back at all. Every two or three songs she would stop to talk to the audience. She gave the most incredible motivational speeches. I like felt like crying during the performance. And when she came on for her finale for Bad Romance, like everyone was on their feet and I was belting it out and it was so incredible. And then after the show, we got all kinds of merch. You might have noticed that I'm wearing my telephone shirt. And I also got this Monster Ball program that has all sorts of like pictures and stuff in it. Yeah. This tote with Lady Gaga's face on it. These sunglasses that have Lady Gaga on the side. And Monster Ball towels in case we want to um, dry our bodies in monster ball towels. Oh, and we also got these little VIP passes. They say, not for sale, no entry to venue without ticket, no backstage access. So they were really useful. Anyway, it was an amazing, amazing night. There's no way that I can describe how awesome it was. But that's basically my summary of the night. If you haven't seen it and you have the opportunity to, you really should. And if you have seen it, tell me what you thought of it. Thank you so much. I'll see you next week. Bye.